Well, in case you missed our story on the last one room schoolhouse in Florida, here's another look. The historic school in Manatee County is shutting its doors for the final time. SNN's Lyndon Blake has more on what it means to the Duet community. Not all the books on all the shelves, but what the teachers are themselves. For 23 years, Duet Elementary principal and teacher Donna King has touched lives at what is now Florida's last one room schoolhouse. Here we go. The school that opened its doors during the Great Depression in 1930 closes for good June 9th when King retires. She's sad her students are forced to give up their intimate school experience. Today I cut uh, watermelon and tomatoes for them just because we have tomatoes from our garden that the children grew themselves. Low enrollment and funding is shutting the school down. It almost closed in 2009. That year, King started the Duet Education Foundation to contract the school. In 2012, King did something else to keep the doors open. I stopped taking the salary so that the to keep the school operating. Love notes from students are enough. A six-year-old wrote me one time. She said, Miss Donna, this is a lot of money. She gave me a hundred dollars, and I'll tell you that check is worth more than a salary. Fifth grader Lena Juarez started at the school in kindergarten. She says she wouldn't trade her one teacher, one room school. I get to meet lots of friends and I get to stay with my brothers all day long. Half of the children in this classroom had their parents drive them from outside of the county just so they could go to Duet Elementary. I think that younger children will learn from older children and also I think older children learn tolerance. King says she will continue to preserve the history of the school as it transitions to a history center. Meanwhile, Juarez is only left with memories of the school that shaped her childhood. It's like my home. It's my community. Reporting in Duet, Lyndon Blake, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. And SNN will be at the last day celebration for the school this Thursday.